Tina Tina. I'm Tisha. And I'm Ashley. And you know we're having a great time here today. It's beautiful. It's, it's wonderful. It's been a long time since we've... It's been a long time since we've been here. Stay. You know, we've been just traveling everywhere. And but... doing so many people. I know, so many people. But it's fun. It's always fun. But anyways, we gotta go to a quick break. We'll be right back. Stick Stay around. Tuned. Stay tuned. Stick around. I know. <laughs> And we are back. You know, we've been in school for a while yeah, now. A couple and it years. is boring, as always. Ashley, how is your first year in high school going? I thought like all the seniors and the juniors were gonna be so mean, but they're not. They're not at all. Like every, like they're they're really nice. They're not. I thought they were gonna be like you know. I was like that too. Get away from me, you little freshman. And I'm like, they called us ankle biters back in when we first I, started. I thought school. they were gonna be so mean. I was like, oh my god, I'm so I'm so scared because like seniors. I was just like, oh my. Would you go to school all pretty the first day? Oh, yeah. New clothes. Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. definitely. It was fun, though. I like all my teachers, and except my second period class is the most boring class I've ever been in in my life. FCAT's going to be coming up again. I know. So Here we go again. But your FCAT's not going to count for I your know. ninth grade year, so it'll just so. be like kind of a warm-up. See, I took it last year, and I failed. Then I, I just don't understand why I have to study for it if it's not going to count. Because it prepares you for the test that is going to count. Would you rather just jump into the test? Well, we don't call them, we don't call our FCAT, FCAT this year. We call it our finals. Who's calling it the finals? All you our teachers. teachers. All our teachers. Huh. They don't call Maybe it they're going to count it as the finals. I don't know. I don't but know. I don't want to do it. That's all I know. All I know is it helps you prepare for it because my ninth grade year when I took it, you know, it helped me to understand what was going to be on the test for this year, well, next, last year. Yeah. And I failed the reading part, so I gotta take that. For I never failed, but I passed that's my math. favorite subject. Reading is my favorite. See, but that's subject. not my favorite. Subject. But I don't. I don't like to read when I'm like bored. I don't read. But when see, I'm I don't reading understand. class, I, I only like failed by six points. And see, this is what I don't understand because I actually, you know, what I'm saying I actually took the time to read the stories, and I still failed it. So y'all, I love to read. They are serious about this. In class, FK. though, you gotta crack down on it because without it, you ain't getting no high school diploma, and then you're stuck there. So unless you want your GED, which a lot of jobs ain't taking no more, yep. you guys got to buckle down because it's real serious. But you're in 11th, right? Yeah. Do I don't even want to talk about it. Why? It's just, just horrible. My teachers are nice, but I got, what classes do I have? Let's see, I got physical science. I'll have that next semester. Um, geometry, American history honors. I don't know. Oh, I have intensive reading because I feel that. <laughs> I feel like a little kindergarten in that class. But then oh I have God. I have a lab class where you know I'm on the computer. The lowest English class we have is English one, and I have English three. How are you all the way in English three? Because I had A's and B's all through my whole language arts class last year, and my language arts teacher recommended me for a higher English class. Why well, is she just lucky? Because now she only has to take one smart. more year. Because I'm smart. It's because I'm smart. What are you in honors? Well, it's kind of like Are that, you trying to size me down? Because I'm an English three, and I'm a junior, and you're only a freshman? Yeah. Are you trying to size me down? It's not working. Ashley, it's Well, I mean, so that's pretty bad that you're a junior and you're intensive reading, Tisha. Come Look, on. that's because I failed the FCAT, and they were taking this real serious. Everybody who failed the FCAT, if they failed the math, they're in an intensive math class. If they I failed the reading, high score in the reading, they're in an intensive reading. The math is what I... I bombed the math part. I hate well, see, that. I don't know if your school's gonna take it as serious as ours, cause ours we were we went from a B school to a D school, and like they got really really uptight, cause like none of the kids want to learn anymore. Nobody wants to be in school anymore. So now they have kids signing contracts. Might I add, I'm on one of those contracts. For what? Oh, I have to be, you know, cause last year I didn't really attend school as much as I should have, and you know took it for granted and kept playing around, and y'all, that's not a good thing to do. Because I did it. She's not a good Don't follow me because they buckle down. At the age of 16, you no longer have to be in school. They can kick you out. You do not have to go to school no more. And your parents will not get arrested for it anymore. So it's up to you whether or not you want your education. And believe me, you want it because it's important. Yeah, so. If you want a good job. <laughs> and if you have parents like mine, psh, you're going to be going to school. Because, <laughs> boy, they put their foot... They just kicked oh me in, in my butt. They gave me a kick in the butt. Anyways, Ashley has a new boyfriend. I wonder how long this one's gonna last. A long time, cause that's what you said about the last no, I did one. Not. The one before that, and the one before that. Whatever. 
I'm just kidding. If Ashley's boyfriend's watching this, don't take it offensive. Seriously, Whichever one you are. He does are. watch the show too. Thanks a lot, Tisha. Good, Thank good, you. good. He needs to know some stuff about you. Whatever. There you go. He knows everything about me. By the time you see this, you guys probably won't be together. And if you are together, then you're not going to like me. So, that's okay though. Well, that's I don't okay because really nobody likes Tisha. Exactly. The only person that likes me is my family and my boyfriend, which I've been with my boyfriend for a year and a couple months. Well, good for you. That's right. But anyways, you know what? He's got you tied down. That's right. And that's good. So anyways, you know what we're going to do? What? What we always got to do. Good over. Yeah. One of those things. Darn. So you guys are just going to have to stick around, you know, because we'll be right back. Yeah, what she said. We'll be back.